Hello, my name is Emmanuel Champo. In this video, I am going to talk you through the process of becoming a basic emergency care course instructor. As you know, the basic emergency care course, or BEC for short, is a course that has been developed by the World Health Organization and International Committee of the Red Cross. The aim of the course is to teach a structured approach to evaluating and treating patients from the pre-hospital to the hospital setting for all healthcare providers. If you are interested in becoming a BEC course instructor in your community or country to increase BEC training capacity, you are in the right place because this video will help you to get started on that journey. To begin, it is important to know that the BEC instructor training is designed to be undertaken by healthcare providers who have successfully completed a certified BEC provider course. Potential instructors have a strong understanding of BEC provider content, are able to communicate effectively, and are willing to teach and mentor others. We follow the training of trainer cascade approach. This means that once a BEC provider is recognized as having instructor potential, they are eligible to be invited to a training of trainers course, also known as a TAT course, which is the first of a series of steps towards becoming a BEC instructor. BEC TOT courses are certified by the International Committee of the Red Cross or the International Federation for Emergency Medicine. The training of trainer cascade approach includes three levels of BEC instructors. Please note that ICRC and IFEM have slightly different requirements, so please check with the organization certifying your course. The first level is that of the provisional facilitator. Provisional facilitators are newly qualified instructors who have just completed the BEC TOT course. Provisional facilitators are able to teach on BEC provider courses under the supervision and guidance of a master trainer. The second level is that of the registered facilitator. In order to become a registered facilitator, a provisional facilitator must have taught at least one BEC provider course under the supervision and guidance of a master trainer and have been certified by the master trainer. Registered facilitators are able to teach BEC provider courses independently, without supervision. Registered facilitators are, however, not qualified to teach a BEC TOT course. The master trainers are the highest level of BEC instructors. In order to become a master trainer, registered facilitators must successfully and independently conduct at least two BEC provider courses. Master trainers are able to teach on BEC provider courses teach on BEC TOT courses and supervise provisional facilitators who are progressing in the training cascade. If you need more information on how to become a BEC instructor, feel free to contact us for further assistance. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.